And the winner is... Hey y'all, I'm James Wright and welcome to my shop. It's been another good week and we've got a few things going on. Uh, this last week I did a video on shop lights and I really kind of went into what should you look for in shop lights and what did I actually choose uh, to light the new shop space. And I'm really, really loving these lights. They have um, absolutely changed the shop and I'm so looking forward to actually building the bench and getting everything down into that space and using them to their full potential. I um, had a lot of people talking to me about the color and my camera is white balanced uh, to the fluorescent lights, the warmer lights. Um, so when I go down there it looks very cold because the camera is focused to these. Once I actually change over the camera for working with those lights um, and, and the new color that I'm choosing, um, then it will look much better and warmer like this. So uh, yeah, don't worry about that as much. Uh, that's a camera problem. The second video I had was making a sliding dovetail. It's a, a obviously simple joint, but uh, it kind of scares some people off because it's a, a larger, more mechanical functioning joint. And uh, some people are a little bit afraid of it, but it's a fairly simple joint once you break it down into its components and figure out what it needs to do. Um, and I really liked how this one came out. It, it's a, you know about five, 10 minutes to make one of these in this, in this wood. And uh, I, I, it's one of my favorite joints. It's a very simple one. So I did a video on making that. Um, I'm wanting, I'm thinking about doing a video on making a tapered sliding dovetail so that uh, when it gets all the way in, it's seated solidly. Um, but I don't know, we'll see. Uh, I've got several other videos I wanna do uh, first. This next week, I'm going to be doing a video on making a bench in the woods. Uh, this should be kind of an interesting one. I'm actually going to be taking a bunch of my tools, putting them in a backpack, and go hiking off into the woods and make a bench from a few, very few simple tools and uh, kind of have a little bit of fun with it. So I'm kind of looking forward to that one. A little different, but uh, should be interesting. The second video of the week, I'm not 100% sure what I want to do. I've had a lot of people asking me, how do you sharpen a V-gouge? So I'm thinking about doing that video, although I'm not quite sure. I might, I might not. Um, I might do the tapered dovetail. Um, I don't know. I, I might, if I can get the carving project done, have this project done. I'm actually doing a, um, a camp sign, and so it'll be uh, for Camp Joy. I'll be um, carving out these letters, um, I'm cutting out these letters, and then I will applique them down and then carve away the background so it looks like these are popping out of the board. And uh, that should be a fun one. It's a very fairly large piece, about uh, three foot long, about 18 inches tall. Um, it'll be this uh, sign that goes in the middle of a uh, pulpit in the chapel. So yeah, that should be uh, a fun one. So for the monthly Patreon giveaway, I'm giving away this infill shoulder plane. Uh, this it appears to be one that was made by a kit uh, from someone in their shop. Um, didn't do the best work on it, and uh, there's some things that I probably would change on it, but I will leave that for the new owner so you can uh, experiment and have the fun with it. Um, but that being said, it's still functional, works well, and uh, it's a kind of a cool plane, and so I think this will make someone very happy. So this plane is going to give away to to Frank Tippin, uh, one of the patrons on Patreon. So Frank, um, I'll give me your address and I'll be getting that out to you uh, if you want it. If you don't, I'll pick someone else, but <laughs> yeah. Um, so yeah, I hope uh, you enjoy this. Uh, I'm gonna be doing a new giveaway every month. I don't know what I'm gonna be giving away next month, but it was open to anyone who's a patron on Patreon. So if you wanna find out more about that, I'll leave a link to that down below. On a similar topic, I've had a lot of people asking me about t-shirts. I've been out for a while, um, and so rather than printing them myself and shipping them out, I'm actually going through a third-party service now. So if you go to my website, um, I'll leave a link to it down below. Um, I do have shirts for sale again, so if you are interested in getting those, um, they are uh, back out again. So <laughs> yeah, looking forward to that. Um, also, I'm going to be at Handworks in a week from this weekend. Uh, this should be a lot of fun, and I'm really looking forward to this. If you have if you haven't been to Handworks, it's something that only happens every two years. Um, it is an absolute blast. It's an, a group get together that is basically nothing but hand tools. Um, so like Roy Underhill will be there. Um, all of the, the big names, Schwartz and, and, and you know, everyone's going to be there. Um, but yeah, all the other hand tool woodworking YouTube personalities are going to be there and it's going to be a lot of fun and I'm looking forward to it. So um, in Iowa, a week from this weekend, um, definitely go look at that. I'll leave a link to that down below as well. 
This week's channel shout out goes to Lightworks, and he is a brand new channel, um, just starting out and really kind of cool. And is looking at the videos, it reminds me a lot of where I started out from, and I'm really looking forward to seeing what he is coming out with. Uh, he just made a video on making a mallet uh, with firewood, very similar to how I made one um, a while ago, and I love what he's doing. Um, some great videos and some great ideas coming out. So if you want to see a new up and coming uh, hand tool woodworker, um, definitely go check out Lightworks, and I'll leave a link to him down below and in the cards right over here. So yeah. So that's about it for this week. I've got a few fun things coming up with a couple little projects here and getting this carving done. And then I'm going to be starting on the saw bench and the main bench. And I am really looking forward to where this is going. So uh, that's about it. I hope you enjoyed this. If you did, please hit like, hit the subscribe button if you haven't already. Also, if you'd like to be entered into the monthly Patreon giveaways, you can find out more right down over here. I do want to say an incredible thank you to Patreon. You're the reason this is going today. If you did like the video, feel free to check out one of my others. You might find something you like there. And until next time, have a wonderful day.